What is going on everybody? Patrick Wick here and today we're going to be doing a video on some other clearance items. I went back to that Walmart and found some more stuff and I also picked up another clearance item from Meyer, and I'm going to be showing that and one other thing and they are the two new additions that I am adding to the 1000 subscriber giveaway box. As you know I don't show very much that goes into there but one of these things you've already seen and the other one is just something that I picked up just, you know, because I want that box to have a little bit of everything. So, um, my goal going forward is to have videos Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. If I have a busy week, that may not happen. Um, I'm a little short on getting this video out uh, for Wednesday, so here it is Thursday. However, that is the goal going forward for the videos that I want to be able to put out a week. And if that eventually changes to more, or less i will definitely let you know and we will make sure that content still comes out regularly that is my goal and that is my promise so whether it's me not catching fish because the spillway monster still eludes me and i'm just freezing my butt off out there for an hour or if i end up catching fish finally which that will happen when the weather gets better i promise you that because i am a good angler these fish are just making me look not so much so right now with the cold weather, but you know, it is what it is. And uh, you know, I'm still gonna have unboxings and I'm still gonna go clearing shopping and all that kind of good stuff too. So let's go ahead and jump into it. And I'm going to show the receipt for the pricing. It's the, uh, the bottom stuff there that's cheap. The 65 cents, 50 cents, 32, or dollar 32, dollar 35, whatever. It looks backwards to me. It's going to look good to you. <laughs> Gotta love computers and how cameras work. So, yeah. And one of them was a very big surprise, and you're going to see that by the sticker. So, I did this new thing my wife recommended, and she's like, hey, let's take these clearance item things and go scan them on the scanner to see if they're any cheaper because. Her friend next door told her that, you know, sometimes prices are different on the clearance items. You just have to scan them. And lo and behold, there's truth behind that with some of these items. So, as you've seen from the thumbnail, I grabbed that last package of this Berkeley Power Bait Max Scent. I wanted to be able to go ahead and grab this. It may end up in the thousand subscriber giveaway i'm not sure yet i may hold on to it but at 350 i couldn't beat it of course they had to do the whole void out thing again because it did the regular pricing but they fixed it and we're good to go the next thing is some real snot for a dollar 35 my neighbor actually bought some of this for me too, and I was going to take it out and try to catch fish on it and use it. But I haven't been able to do that because the weather is not permitting me to be able to do that. But it also says that it's a line conditioner, so I may try it out as a line conditioner. But shout outs to Haley for doing that and picking some of this up. I did find another bottle, so this is definitely going to be something that you're going to be seeing going forward. And then the next thing is something you already seen. The Gurgle Toad says 90 cents. I think it came out to be 50 cents. So, again, you know, white body, that's a good color. And we'll go ahead and actually, because I don't think I did it in the last video where I got these. I don't think I took any of them out. So here's that Gurgle Toad. It's got this nice little spot where the hook could sit. If you use a single hook, it's got like the two ribbon tail curly grub style so they're going to really give a lot of action when it's going across the top of the water there. It's got like the little warts from the frog and the eyes. The belly has this kind of ridging right here, which is going to help cut the water, make it more streamlined, give it kind of like a V angle. So it's going to actually, you know, make a lot of movement on the water and, and give it that, um, like something swimming, it's going to give that V cut and have that little trail of water behind it. Just like when the bass are swimming or fish are swimming underwater and you see that V kind of pattern, you know, that's the shape that it is. So I'm guessing that's going to do that. But I'm excited to try these when the time comes. And I wanted to show those outside the box because last time I didn't. So then the next thing, and I think these were 
Okay, so I think the Gurgle Toad was $0.65, cents and then these guys were the $0.50. Cents. But they had some arky, sexy, shad, little um, black magic, is what they're called, with a J, not a G. This little crappie jig, and it's got that nice single tail that makes so much action like that, and that chartreuse, it's black-bodied. It's just going to be a good profile, and that tail does a lot of action, a lot of wiggling. It's going to entice the fish, and I'm thinking about maybe taking this and, and jigging it um, when we get complete ice over, and I can actually go out on the ice and maybe try ice fishing. I've never done it before. It's something I'm thinking about doing, but I am somewhat of a heavier dude, and I don't trust the snow. I weigh 260, and I'm like 5'9", so... Me being a little bit on the, the weightier side, I don't trust the, uh, the ice beneath me right now, especially not right now. Maybe if it was like four to five inches, I, I might trust it. You know, I see people drive trucks out on, on areas where there's snow and, and have the whole shebang, but I don't know. I just, the ice is one of those things where it's, it's super dangerous to be messing around on especially for somebody like me who's never done it before and I don't have a buddy to go out with me and I do it solo. So that may or may not be something you see from me, um, especially as a solo fisherman uh, without somebody out there with me because it can get very dangerous and I don't recommend doing it by yourself if, if you go out and do it unless you know for sure the area that you're at and you've done it multiple times and have the experience, you know, just breaking through the ice. Not only do you have the hypothermia, but you know, if you get stuck underneath there, you can drown. It's just a, a dangerous thing. So always make sure you have a buddy if you are going to try ice fishing. I would recommend that um, just for safety measures specifically. So, but enough with the safety. <laughs> We're going to get into the next item, and that is the KVD, and it's the Gizzard Shad. It's the 2.5. It says dive range is 3 to 5 feet, so it's pretty shallow. It's not too deep. It's a nice profile, a little bit bigger than the 1.5s. Um, you know, I know the fish will bite on this. It says $4.75 on here. This actually was $2.50. Crankbait, $2.50. That's what that $2.50 or $2.40. KVD crankbait, $2.40. And that was, this is the one that surprised me scanning it with the scan gun after my wife had, had said that. And, you know, so when you see 475 and then you go over there and you scan it and it says 240, I was like, well, we've got to get this. You know, 475 isn't, isn't too far off of the normal price. So I was just like, eh, you know, it's only a little bit off. Let's wait and see if it drops. But 240, yes, all day long, I will buy them all day long. Good, 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 good. So the next item, if you've watched my videos before, You've seen this. If you haven't, this is new to you, possibly. But it is the Nico or Neko, however you pronounce it. I think it's Nico. This is a Nico rig kit. Comes with everything you need. Two hooks, one weedless, and one normal. They all have the nail weight. They all have the little split ring here where you can hook it. And you've got, as you can see, six of them. This was on clearance from $8.99 for $5.32. So another decent deal. And I had to grab one. I have two for myself, and I show them off. And with them being on clearance still, I was like, you know what? This would be a good addition to the 1,000 subscriber mystery box that I'm putting together. It's not a total mystery, obviously, because a few things you do know of, but a lot of it you don't, which is the way I'm going to keep it. And the last thing that I am going to add to the 1,000 mystery box that you are going to see is going to be this guy. This fire tiger pattern popper. There's a, like I said, every style I'm trying to incorporate in that 1,000 subscriber box that I am designing. So when you get it, you will literally be able to fish any style for bass um, and other fish. So it's all cohesive. It'll all work together. It's going to have a little bit of everything, you know, from spring to to fall um not so much winter like i said i don't ice fish much so i don't really look for clearance or or buy ice fishing stuff but 
from spring to fall, definitely going to have everything that you would like to try or need to go fishing for bass um, and panfish. So this is another cool one that I wanted to throw in there. Fire Tiger is a good river color, a uh, good all-around color. It's just very bright, very vibrant for those muddier waters. So it was something I wanted to grab and, and throw into the 1,000 subscriber uh, mystery box. So with that being all shown, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed the things that are in here. Um, let me know what your favorite thing was. Uh, can't beat that price on that KVD for $240. Uh, that blew my mind. I was absolutely blown away by that. Uh, fantastic find. And I'm glad my wife found it because she's the one who found it too. She was digging in the bin and it was underneath like some sort of like knee pad or something like that for a child's uh, roller blading or, or skateboarding. So <laughs> it was a good find. It was a good price. If you like this video, hit that like button, hit that red subscribe button, that bell notification. Make sure you leave me comments. And always, thanks for sticking with me, and I'll catch you all later.